Well, I'm gonna say that as far as artists, I think each and every one played a part in Mr. Gordy's vision to carry it out, to make Motown what it has become 60 years later. Uh, Mary Wells had a very big part of um, being the female artist, solo female artist that uh, became quite po popular with uh, her song, My Guy, uh, which was actually written, one of the songs that was written by Smokey. And um, of course, Marvin Gaye, of course, the Marvelettes. The Marvelettes had actually the first number one seller, not the first million seller, but the number one. Our song, Shop Around, only went to number two because unfortunately for us, the Beatles would not get off of that number one spot and we were really pushing, but they stayed on it for weeks and weeks and weeks. But uh, proud to say, even though we were number two, it was the first million seller. But you know, on top of Marvin Gaye, it was the Marvelettes, it was uh, Martha and the Vandellas with Dancing in the Streets. Um, when Stevie came, of course, you know, later on, it was um, Michael Jackson and the Jackson Five, or I should reverse that and say the Jackson Five and Michael Jackson. And so many others, there's so many artists that people probably don't even recognize. Some only had one hit, but those hits were just dynamic. And when people heard of all the hits that were coming out of Motown, because we had like the whole chart, the first 10 uh, out of the national charts would be Motown, Motown artists. So um, I can't say enough for all those people that were there that made an impact on not just Detroit, but fortunately for all of us, the world and helping Mr. Gordy's vision become a reality.